How to bulk import reviews to your Shopify store. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can bulk import your reviews onto Shopify. So we have already downloaded Luke's reviews as our primary review widget. And let's say we have a couple of reviews on our product, but we want to bulk import reviews that we created in the past. So you can do that very easily and very simply. So to do that, simply head on over to your Shopify dashboard. Once you are on your Shopify dashboard, on your left panel, you have your Luke's reviews. From here, you're going to click on the reviews section. Once you click on the reviews section, you will have the preview section over here. And from here, you want to select import reviews. Now you have multiple different ways of importing or bulk importing reviews. So you have the one click import from AliExpress. Now this is primarily for people that are running their Shopify stores on the dropshipping method. So if you are using dropshipping, it's very likely that your products, even if they're from Deezer's or any other third party platform, they're usually from AliExpress. So you can import the reviews that were given over there. Then you can also import your reviews from Shopify supported apps. So they have their supported apps such as the Shopify product reviews, Yachtpo, Junip, Okendo, and JudgeMe. So if you were previously using these platforms to store or collect reviews, you can upload them over here. Now, after that, you have a spreadsheet format that you can use. So this is usually the way that most people like to import their reviews simply because it's easier and simpler. So as you guys can see, you can uh, copy the template file. So this will open up a Google Doc sheet and it will show you how you should structure your Excel sheet or a Google Doc sheet. So on the first section, you're always meant to add the product handle. Now, what is the product handle? So if you're looking to build this sheet, make sure to enter the information correctly. So it's led to all of the correct items. Now the product handle, and I'll show you guys step by step how to build this. So let's say I just downloaded a Excel copy of this but now as you guys can see over here we have excel copy of our sheet now in your product handle you're always meant to add your widgets or the url slug so let's say i want to add a review to uh this product over here sample t-shirt now what you're going to do is you're always going to copy this url section the url slug so at the last dash of your url whatever is the final word in your url that is what you're going to add in the section of your product handle so you're going to paste that over here so you can click on over here like this now once you do that you're going to add your rating let's say it's a five rating and then you're going to add the name so janet a and then you're going to enter the email the email option is um it's optional and then you're going to add the body so whatever the person wrote in their review or whatever you want the person to write in their review like this and then you can enter the date and then you can add the photo url if you want to insert a photo into the review so i'm gonna add a simple photo from Bektizi. And to do that, I can just open up any photo. I'm just going to search for t-shirts over here like this. And then after that, you're going to just take a look at, you know, the free images. So I'm just going to search for that over here. And then I'm just going to copy the link or we can just do a simple link from any website like this. I'm just going to do a right click and then copy the image address. So open the image in a new tab and then just copy the URL. And then you're just going to insert that into your Excel sheet like this. Now, after that, so we're just going to make sure that this is, you know, complete, making sure the entire adding this over here. And then from here, we're going to add the section of true if this is a verified purchase or not. So after you have completed this, you're going to click on file on the top left and then you can click on download. Download this as a Microsoft Excel sheet. And then if we go back into our Shopify dashboard, we can click on upload our template file. And then I'm just going to go on ahead and so we're going to go into import reviews and then we're going to upload our template file 
and going into downloads it's not letting us download our xls file so you do have to convert that into a csv file so just open up microsoft excel i'm just going to go into the home section and we're just going to search for our file over here like this we're going to open this up and then we can just click on save as and then you're going to save this as a csv file like this in your downloads make sure it's a csv file and once you have saved it as a csv file you can click on upload over here and click on open now once your file has been uploaded you will get a processing email and once the process has been completed the reviews will be added into your store so this might seem like a long process when you're doing it for the first time however when you do this a couple of times and you know what type of information and you guys can see our review has been added smooth and soft perfect for the summer janet a one review so with the image as well so this is just an example of how you're going to format your csv file and you can add hundreds and thousands of reviews and all of those can be bulk imported within a second so it's pretty simple and easy it doesn't have anything too complicated and anyone can easily follow along now with luke's reviews you can do a lot more as well and if you want to add more types of review widgets and a lot of other uh, trust badges that can help boost the site uh, reliability you can go into customize and you can go into your home pages and even add testimonial sections you can click on add section over here and you have trust badges testimonial carousels on-site referrals gallery carousel carousel widgets as well as card carousel so all of these can help you in building and establishing more trust within your website now alongside having bulk imports you also might want to add bulk products so if you are doing bulk product imports, then you can also go into product over here. And on the top right, you have the option to export your product and then import them as well. Now, a easy life hack is to import or export your CSV file of your pre-existing products. And then you can actually add all of your review information and format it as the review section. And this can be easier to expedite the bulk import of your reviews. Now, other than that, you can always import your shopify products directly onto your shopify store and you also have different options which can help you in you know ex exporting information for certain products and then once you export this information you're going to be able to access all of your products in an excel sheet once you have that you can format this according to your pre-existing format that we just took a look of so like this sheet over here i've added one of my products over here but you can add as many as you want and because you would already have them added in your bulk imports if you directly import your product list it just makes it easier to format it in that way now starting from scratch is always a good option and with luke's reviews you have multiple different options to format your review sections however you want so i hope you guys found this video helpful and you're now able to get started with using luke's reviews and having bulk import of your reviews make sure to leave a like and subscribe and if you have any questions or queries that i left out in this video make sure to leave those in the comment box down below i would love to know what you guys have to say.